All right, so solving this problem, uh, we want to find the area encompassed between x equals, oops, x equals zero to three, and we're bounded by y, or the y equals zero axis. So it would just be, you know, kind of like this. And if you wrap this around the y axis, all that filled in, and we're using shells. So we're gonna integrate from zero to three. Uh, using shells, it's two pi x and then um, dx, or what we're gonna have here is the square root of x, so, and then dx. So integrated, this becomes two pi, and the integral, oh, I'm not gonna integrate yet, I still gotta, oops, sorry about that. Uh, integrate from zero to three, and then um, if you combine x and x, uh, square root of x, we get x to the three halves, dx, and what we end up with if we integrate this, so we get x to the three halves plus one over three halves plus one, which is five over two. So we end up with um, two pi, um, two over five, x raised to the five halves, I believe. Yeah, I was right. Um, it's good to know. <laughs> Zero to three. Um, so we get, if we integrate this, so 2 pi, and then um, 2 fifths times 3 raised to the 5 halves. Yuck. What we're going to end up with is, uh, and then just 0, uh, 2 fifths times 0 raised to the 5 halves is just 0. So we end up with 2 pi, and then um, this ends up being 8 root 3 over 5. This is 2 pi. So we ultimately end up with the volume encompassed by wrapping this around the y axis is 36 pi square root of 3 over 5. All right, that's it. Hope this helped you out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.